welcome back to my channel. I'm Jen. Thank you so much for joining me today. We're going to check out some clearance stuff I've picked up at the craft stores local to me. Um, today we went to Hobby Lobby and Joanne. Uh, Hobby Lobby, like for my area, and I've noticed recently has just started marking things down. Basically, they're clearing the shelves for spring release. Um, and they're resetting everything. In fact, one of the ones we went to today was stocking tons of stuff all over the store. They have pretty decent deals on planners. And I've seen people getting sticker books. They basically have been wiped out by us. Um, some extension packs, things like that. So definitely, if you're looking for planners from the fall line, the 18-month release, or even some undated, Hobby Lobby's a good bet. Um, Joanne had a lot of the same stuff they've had for a while. I picked up a couple of things there that were not on clearance. I'll share everything with you guys. Um, but their clearance wasn't as good. It generally isn't, but typically at some point they add like an extra percent off and that was not going on right now. So I only got a couple things. There are a few things I'd probably pick up if they were cheaper. So I think what I'm going to do is just grab stuff out of a bag and tell you about it. Um, so first I got these Agenda 52 Faith with Foil, it says. They're like planner pockets. Um, they had like a ring binder that matched this, which is so pretty. But And it had a whole full undated calendar, but I know, I know I won't use it. This was $1.74. Um, what I'm thinking I will do, yeah, these are just plain on the back. I think I'm just going to tape these into my planner or a memory spread or whatever because I just really like the designs. I think they're so pretty. They're like a rose gold foil and florals. They're navy and pink and light blue, so they're like right up my alley. <laughs> yeah, these are gorgeous. So... I mean, I'll lose the back design, but it's basically the same as the front. So that comes with four. So four for, what did I say? $1.74. That was a good deal. I don't have a ring binder or I'd use them for that, but I definitely like can put stickers and stuff in here. So thinking I'm going to tape them in or make, I could make like, get some sturdy cardstock or something and make like a pocket folder with some sticky notes, something like that. So they're super cute. Um, I forgot to see what the size was and I dropped. Oh, maybe it's on here. It is not. Okay. Sorry. I don't know what size they are. I did pick up these Valentines for 29 cents. Includes 48 heart seals, it says. They're just little Grogu Valentines. I might use them for planning next year, but I'm mostly I'll probably give them to my girls. Um, I found these stamps. They were $1.62 and I do not have them. This is so cute. They're like making a heart. Love you. All time favorite. So I may stamp in my Hobo Nietzsche. So I was thinking normally $6.49, $1.62. Good deal. Um, this is just something I picked up that was on sale for 40% off. It's just, you know, one of these like not stony clover patches that everyone's starting to carry for um, somebody else. This is also for somebody else. But I do have some of these in my other bag. Work plus life, like, bullet points. Um, this is the life neutral minimalist sticker fan book. I'm not going to open this one since it's going to somebody else. But um, they are only $3.74 and they were $15, which is why I never bought any of the stickers from that line because it wasn't worth it. This is also for somebody else. These are super cute. They were current. They were on sale. This one looks kind of bent though. Um, and they're just kind of like, it's this moody floral and they're like floral clips and bookmarks. Very cute. Definitely at my alley, but decided not to go with that. And let's see, I've got this wooden rubber stamp. It says choose joy. Since that's the, my word of the year, I thought that would be a nice thing I could use for like joy pages. It was only $1.24, which is pretty good for a wooden stamp. It's normally $6.99, so not so bad. And last, I picked up this extension for $7.49. Normally 
this is, I probably shouldn't have bought this. Okay. This cannot be right. They must have marked this by mistake as a planner price because it wasn't even a good price. <laughs> well, now I kind of want to take that back. I don't know. Yeah, I thought that seemed high for an extension. I could have just bought it regular price. Because <laughs> that isn't really a good deal. Okay, I should look closer at this. I do think that's really cool. And I thought I'd use it for potentially tracking for the baby. Because it's like an hourly layout and it's undated. Hmm. Now I might take this back out. Let me see. Cricut Silva. I'm trying to make sure. Okay. I'm probably going to take this back, which is going to be a pain in the butt because I um, didn't really want to go back to Hobby Lobby. But I, yeah, I'm going to tell him, be like, I don't think this is marked right. Okay, well, that's on me, though, really, for not paying attention either. Yeah, another one. So that was the second store. This is the first store. I picked up these for my girls. They're only 74 cents, which is probably 80% like off. Um, we were watching Looney Tunes the other day. They can go in their Easter baskets, maybe, I was thinking. They love stickers. They'll be used. Um, I also got this for them. This is non-planner stuff, obviously. It was 40% off. Just a craft that we can do. I got these for some, like, scatter stuff for my pictures. They're just little Easter and spring little wooden pieces. I also might make some, like, clips with them or craft with them. I might give some to the kids at some point. Um, I got this cute thing to hang up from Easter because it's a candy it says cottontail candy shop jelly beans chocolates and candy eggs making candy at Easter was one of my favorite things job oh and I got some little Easter eggs too for photos um and I got these little hair ties for my girls they're so cute and I have two girls and there was two in the pack so all that stuff was 40% off okay here is a work plus life thing that I am keeping they didn't have this one at the second one. So again, $374. Oh, it feels nice. It says, without risk, there would be no magic. I like that. Okay, so these are like paper. So we got circles. And I like these colors because they're mostly black and gray. And I do use dots a lot. So these, I might, I might put these in a pouch attached to my planner or something. Um, bigger dots. Some triangles, like corners. The shape squares, some little, like tabby arrow things, honeycomb shape. These are like little strips or underlines you could probably use them for. Okay, and those are all paper. These, however, are clear. So you got arrows, teardrops, um, half moons. Some little more dots, more triangles, more squares. I think there were squares. Yeah, honeycomb. And some more strips. These are really nice. There is a lot in here. There's a 1,643. So this is an excellent deal. These are just so expensive. Even at the sale price, they were too much for me. Um, you do get a lot, like I get it. And this is a higher price point line, but, um, these just took a long time to get marked down. There are, there is like a pastel one. There is like a, the more neutral one that I had, um, shown you guys. And then there's like a gold foil one, which I don't think I would use as much as this one. So that's why I went with this one. And gold foil, you know, hard to, hard to photo. Okay, the last two things from Hobby Lobby are planners. So this one is a $35 planner. It was $8.74. Uh, 
Um, this is the uh, Graceful Heart one, which I wasn't going to get, but then I looked at the color of these discs and they are so bright and vibrant and almost purple blue. It's so hard to explain. I didn't I feel like I've looked at them, but I do not have a color like this exactly. I do have some other dark blue, but this one is a little different. So I really got them for the discs. Um, this cover is really cute. So spread more joy. So I will probably use this cover at some point. Oh, look at the inside. I have a, I like blue. So this is vertical and this is, what were the dates on these? This is just a 2023. So it's only two months in. So that's cool. Um, it's going to be colorful. This is one of the collab pieces. Look at how pretty is that? I like this part in the front. Oh my gosh. I do have the stickers and washi that match this planner. Um, I haven't seen the pages in person. You know, this isn't, it's not completely neutral, but it's not too bad. It's just a little splash of color. Make every day count. Yeah, these are cute. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use the guts, honestly. I might, I'll probably keep for the, keep for the, <laughs> keep the dividers or some of them. I'll pick the ones that, because I have a lot. I have to go through mine. Chase your dreams. Yeah, the colors change. Believe in the good. Cute. So, I can use these, though, too, if I want. I can always swap them in and set on my floral. It's a good day to have a good day. Be kind to you. That one's pretty. I like that one. Create joy. Okay, I might frame this and hang it up if I ever get my craft area set up because that's my you know word or another possibility is I trim it down and back it with you know something just plain like this and make like a joy page so I'll probably craft with some of the stuff in here I really do like these though I think they're beautiful the ne world needs what you got um like this is potentially something I'd change into a journal divider present. Ooh, I like that one. I like the foil. Own who you are. But yeah, these discs are definitely going to be on my planner at some point this year. It's gorgeous. They're gorgeous. Um, and then there's their collab names. And there's a whole thing about Grace Place Art. I started following her after they announced it. She's super cute and has super pretty stuff. And I love it. Um, I honestly was going to get a horizontal planner that they had because I don't think, I mean, I do have some like horizontal extensions, but, and some old stuff, but I don't, didn't get one because there weren't a lot of choices in the fall. And I, but I do like horizontal a lot, but then I saw these discs and I was like, oh man, <laughs> they're so pretty. So I got that. Um, and then, which they had that one at the second stop. They did not have this one at the second stop. Oh gosh, I hope this isn't scratched. It is, of course. Do not have a lot of okay. Well, this is cut. I hope this isn't scratched, but I, it's cut through. Yeah, it is a little bit. <sighs> anyway, the cyanotype deluxe with the frosted cover. I this was on my want list from this release like it was big time but I just didn't need it and I was like I'm gonna have to come back Hobby Lobby marks things down and luckily the first one I went to had two of them so the number one thing again on this one I wanted were these discs they're this gorgeous navy blue they're the ones with the holes instead of the hearts and they're just beautiful it says a beautiful day begins with a beautiful mindset this is a dashboard. Again, it was $8.74. I mean, just the discs and the cover are worth, like, just the discs are worth the $8.74 because it's so expensive. But this is the frosted cover, so these are a little different. But you can put something else behind here if you wanted, right? I could probably trim some of these dividers. But this is the rest of the cover. It is a little warped, I've noticed. Um, look at that's pretty. I really dig this cyanotype design. I just don't think I'd want it year round. Like it's cause it's monochromatic. Like I would want different colors. I'm just, you know, so I'll probably again, craft up some of this, pull out things like, I really like this. That's pretty. Um, oh yes. 
so pretty. But somebody that is into blue, this is a really nice planner. Okay, so this one's outdated. Look at that. I love that calendar. Okay, and then, yeah, this is super pretty. You don't need it. I could use this, I guess, too. No, see, the problem with this is going to be, I could use this for, like, me. For, like, journaling stuff. Um, the problem with this one is I'm not going to have enough room for tracking, like, diapers and feedings. Greater Beer and Happiness. Yeah, I love these calendars. And I love the blue and silver. Those are my, these are my wedding colors, actually. <laughs> Probably part of the reason I'm like, and my sorority's colors are navy and light blue and silver is an accent. Treasure this day and treasure yourself. Truly, neither will ever happen again. That's cool. I like that a lot. Um, always find time for the things that make you happy. Yeah, I just like they're cool. <laughs> Silver. Yeah, I really like this. So I'm definitely going to use some of this. Like this would be fun to craft with for sure. Or maybe make a spread. These are this one too. See, because like that's not, that's a boring divider for me. Breathe in all possibility that today holds. I think that this is just a great overall planner, especially for someone that's maybe new or not into decorating as much. And then here's the inside back cover and the back cover. And then the back one's just plain frosted with the Happy Planner logo. I'm so happy to have this planner. I wanted it so much, but didn't need it. You know, like it just didn't make sense. And gosh, it's, it's a $35 planner. It's so expensive, even on sale. Okay. Last from Joanne, I got this teacher accessory set, some more crafts for my girls, some Easter crafts, these were 40 off, I think. Um, and then I grabbed, I grabbed these, these are actually older looking th things, I think they're adhesive snap and tabs, because I was just thinking the other day, I wanted to like stick something in on an adhesive and snap it in and it wasn't like it's like a picture or something it wasn't this but you know like you could take something like this peel it off and stick this down and have it as a page in your planner so I just picked some of these up they were um 40% off so are these make your own books I'm still on still organizing and combining things so I'm gonna grab it a couple more while they're on sale let's look at this real quick you what I was thinking. Um, I love these sticky notes on here. I love this teacher design, the Disney one. There's nothing that says teacher on these two. I love, love this. I will make use of that. I've already used through some. This says teacher change the world one child at a time. I'm probably going to put a sticker or something over it or a different quote. I might be able to pull a sticker from this book and put it over here and just cover the quote. It's just, obviously I'm not a teacher, so it's cute. Or I might give it to a teacher friend. I haven't decided. So it comes with some stickers, one sheet, who, where, when. Do you see like homework and due date? Due date's fine. Oh, I will be right back. Okay. So stickers, these are really cute. I really loved this line. There was two different books. There was one at Walmart and then there was like one at Happy Planner and apparently Joanne. No, I think I knew they were at Joan. It was the seasonal ones that, um, anyway, <clears throat> this one says teachers keep it all together. So for the most part up here, the only thing that's really, really school is like the report card, I'd say, um, which doesn't bother me too much. Again, I'm probably going to cover this. Like I'm not going to use this, but look, you could just pop. This one's a little bit big, but I'd, I'll find something that I can pop or cluster over this and make my own folder because it's too cute. It's too cute. And I didn't buy this because everything says teacher, but for, you know, the clearance price, I'm a little bit, I feel a little bit better. And these are not teacher related. They have that adorable Mickey Mouse that I love on the paper. It says, be a highlight in someone's life today. Um, yeah. 
love the paper. I love filler paper. I don't want to be like I collect filler paper, but I basically do. Uh, each sticky pad has 20 sticky notes. I, it doesn't say, but usually there's 20 pages of paper. One. Oh, it's hard to say because they count the stickers as pieces. It says there's 119 pieces total between the stickers and the... But every one of these little dots is a piece, sticker, a piece, you know, so going on um yep love it can cover this up if I just want the mickeys I'm using this like for tracking stuff in my planner this year that design on the like the checklist layout and I think that's it yeah so I am really happy with the things I got except for that one thing that I showed you guys that I was like just doesn't make sense I have to probably take it back which is a pain in the butt but you know, it's what it is. I could take it back Thursday. It's no big deal. I just don't think that price is right. And I think that was supposed to be the planner, right? Like maybe the regular plan. But that's just not because there were other people getting extension packs. I should have known. I don't know why, what I was thinking. Um, but yeah, so those are some of the things that you can find right now at Joanne or Hobby Lobby. Everybody has different stuff. Hobby Lobby's, mine at least, had a lot of planners. They had skinny classics. They had classics. They had bigs, which I didn't get anything big. Um, and they had the Work Plus Life ones. So if you just want one of those binders with the discs, they're like the round metal discs. like um, They're like this, but neutral colors. And they have the nice cardboard or like stiff board binder. It's not cardboard per se. You could store your like 2023 planner in there. And, you know, get rid of the guts. Those were on clearance. They had a pouch. And I know they had stickers and extension packs. Like I said, mine were, both my stores were wiped out. So that's it for today. I hope you guys are having a great day. Let me know down below if you have any questions. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.